vital to the success of a left lateral liver lobe transplant is the portal vein reconstruction. The left portal vein has a distinct angle and curvature, which, using a branch patch portal vein anastomosis technique, will be restored in the recipient during transplantation. Because the liver must be retracted superiorly and to the left to perform the portal vein anastomosis in small pediatric recipients, it is critical to achieve correct orientation of the donor graft and recipient portal veins corresponding to the final resting position of the graft in order to prevent eventual twisting and or kinking of the portal vein at the conclusion of the transplant. The portal vein is left long. To allow it to assume a gentle curve towards the graft left portal vein. In addition, a branch patch is fashioned at the bifurcation of the main portal vein into its right and left branches to achieve a good size match to the graft left portal vein. The native orientation of the left portal vein in the donor is maintained and stay sutures placed in the former lumens of the recipient left and right portal veins. A running suture secures the posterior wall, which rather than being tightened, is kept relatively loose. Interrupted sutures are used to secure the anterior wall to allow for expansion as the child and liver graft grow.